And honestly, the, the, the cheapest thing to repair on bikes is your clutch and new tires. That's literally the best, most easiest thing and performance that's cheap. Yeah. That's gonna save you nonstop. You know, Dude. to have all the thing around. <laughs> Hey, as long oh, as yeah. it runs and it's good and you're happy with it, Hell yeah. don't worry about what it looks like. But the best thing is clutch and tires. Because that's what you that's what you need to have. You need yeah. traction. Yeah. You, know, you, get, gotta, you wanna have traction before it looks. <laughs> you can get arm pump and you tired and you're trying to get up that hill and you're fucking getting cramps. One thing it's I the do, worst. Uh, on my way here, you know the, the squeezers? I keep one in my truck. Yeah, I, I, I use one on the way here. Really? Oh, okay. Yeah, and it already it starts to warm my arm up already yeah because you're, you're cold you're in the morning you know you're freezing you're riding you're, you're driving here you're relaxed you hop on the bike and it starts getting you yep i, I use that i switch back and forth back and forth with hands yeah on the way here and by the time i'm here, all right they're already they're already you know you know move the muscles and yeah moved and they're good and about half the time i don't i don't walk out with our pump nice
post that on video, I think. Oh yeah? You're a little squirrely. Hope I didn't freaking roost you too much. I get a lot of tires spinning here, you know? It seemed a little more tacky. A little bit, yeah. It's, uh, it's absolutely nice to have that one. I like that one. That was yeah. one of my favorites. That was cool. That's why I gotta ask. So when you come up to where the, the, the gate was closed, where they closed it off? Yeah. That's Remember what I told you last time I came out, I got stuck in the, the valley down there? Yeah. That's the trail that goes into that. No shit. I'm guessing people are getting stuck in it too much, and <laughs> so they said, okay, we'll They're shut it off. Yeah, that was a black diamond, huh? Uh, yeah, either way, back to Diamond. It's a oh. Black Diamond Hill climb, Black Dale okay. climb as well. Bracking points right there. Oh yeah, no, I like that's a fun one. That's why I asked, because I know you said you haven't done many of them. That's why I asked, have you done this one? And I was like, yeah, yeah, yeah. I was like, let's go. Yeah. I'm I like, what I like about this one here too, this whole hill climb, yeah, it's a steep one. Yeah. It's levelly steep, so like, yeah, yeah. have to be at high, high It's ICM, consistent, so yeah. You can bog it out and still, you know, cruise it up and have fun with it. Yeah. Those over there, I, uh, a little too much for me. That's actually some of the shit they do oh, the, uh, the uh, what you call it, the National Hill Climbs on. Really? Yeah, that's what they do it here. This is the spot. Yeah, I always come when they always seem to be having those and I can't get in. 
<laughs> yeah, no, they, uh, they, they, they do it big here. A few times ago I was here, I, uh, I took a buddy of mine that's never even really ridden a dirt bike. He doesn't even have a dirt bike, never really, <laughs> never had, you know, been on one. Yeah. And uh, I took him and let him ride this a few times. And the day I, that day I came, there was actually three people with the extended back frame with the whole, you know, and I was like watching them and I yeah. was like, that's why you have an extended frame. Yeah. And they don't go back and forth on you. Yeah. This, <laughs> that guy that I was riding with like, when I first started, <laughs> he's been riding forever like you and he's, he used, he he was doing the extended arms and shit on the little bikes when he was growing up and yeah now he i mean he's a short guy but he gets up on his 450 he just wah, wheelies up doing everything and like i said you're taking him down black diamonds and i just i, I could do a lot of these i just haven't my confidence isn't that high but it's also it's you know if you're riding alone too you don't want to have true an area where you're get not stuck. comfortable with get hurt or you something. don't yeah you don't put yourself that's how i am like there's yeah. areas like I knew the trails I've gone on, like I did last time when I knew I went down, that I knew it was going to be a struggle for me, but I didn't realize it was going to be that big of a struggle. <laughs> you know? Yeah. I was like, oh, it's a little bit more than it normally is. And I know if we go to the top of this, I still want to get over there. Yeah. That's my main goal. For all of our trails to get over there. Well, I used to wear the... Uh elbow pads but the straps oh, give me hell a bad arm pump and I, don't know, I don't ever touch arm pads yeah. unless i'm at the track i got a chest protector on and the knee pads but yeah I, i've got chest protectors but i mean you're you're so good yeah, you don't have to worry about it for a while <laughs> i do the knee pads you know and i you know helmet it but if i know i'm gonna go hardcore and major then i'll throw on the chest protector right. I've got a, uh the raptor fox so it does the whole wrap the you know rib cage wrap and all that I like that. It's comfortable. Yeah. It's just look blue. It feels like I'm wearing. I knew I was riding with you today, so I'm like, I'll put it on. <laughs> no, yeah, sometimes I ride them, sometimes I don't. Yeah, I no. Uh, for me, I just when I'm at a like an OHV park, I'm cruising. Yeah, I'm it's not cool. going major. I'm yeah. not fucking hitting. You know. I was expecting it to be packed today too. So huh? yeah, I was expecting a lot of people to be here. So it's well, a lot of little kids coming around the corner. We were coming down this. When we were coming in off the the main road at the entrance. Yeah. Like, packed all the way to the corner. Yeah. So. uh as yeah. I said, it's it's because also uh, stays running.